What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the Glass Garage where we make detail and simple. My name is Hawk and today I have something special for you guys. So today I'm going to go ahead and just showcase the other stuff that I ended up getting from Labo Cosmetica because I'm going to use the entire line on a vehicle that's coming over the weekend. So stay tuned for that video and we're going to start from from A to Z using just the Labo Cosmetica line. So let's go ahead and do a quick recap. So don't forget, I ended up getting the first batch came in. It was a Ned Hole, which is a mineral stain remover. This is a lot stronger than their Purifica. This is more of a dedicated to really deep clean and remove those minerals as well as it can actually remove the minerals off the paint because it's a lime scale remover as well. Ended up getting Neaty though, my favorite glass cleaner period to date at the moment. I am going to try Belt Hamber's Traceless. So whenever that's released in the States, I'm gonna go ahead and buy that. I also did get Purifica, which you guys saw that video. But the, but the good thing about it is this time I'm gonna be using the entire line the correct way. I was still waiting for my pressure washer hose. So when I got the Purifica, it, I couldn't do the actual three pH uh, soap to go ahead and unclog the ceramic coating the way it's dedicated to be. So pretty much you go ahead and foam on Primus, then you foam on Purifica, then you do your contact wash, then you do Semper, all this other stuff. So I'm gonna be doing the steps to go ahead and prep. And next time when I unclog another ceramic coating, I'm gonna just be using the 3PH soap method where I'm gonna use the foam cannon. If you guys haven't watched my unboxing on the hose reel on how to install your brand new pressure washer hose onto your cox reel, just go ahead and look at that. But Primus was another one that I ended up getting over there. Now, next up is just a quick rundown of everything else I got. So Semper is their pH neutral shampoo. So this is their concentrated pH neutral shampoo after you're done doing these three to go ahead and neutralize all those chemicals. Next up, I ended up getting Fierro. So if you guys haven't seen Eddie, Eddie's video on Fierro, he says this is an amazing primer polish to go ahead and install a ceramic coating. So I can't wait to give this a shot and see how it actually, you know, how it actually performs. You know, Eddie does a lot of testing. He just doesn't say something is good to say. So I'm really excited to go ahead and use this. Next up is Beneficia. So no reviews on this one yet. So what I read online, this looks like quick beads in a sense for Labo Cosmetica. So it's quick beads, you know, wet coat, etc. Cause you just go ahead, spray on, and then you go ahead, let it dwell and then rinse off. And I'm gonna be using this for the wheels. Next up is Neto. Neto is their tire dressing. So for their tire dressing, I don't really expect much to be honest, just as long as it doesn't sling, it goes on nice. It leaves a nice finish. And that's it. I don't expect literally nothing else, nothing more from this product. Next up is Glico. So I ended up getting Glico is their acid-based fabric cleaner. And Ductile or Ductili, I don't know how to say it, is their all-purpose cleaner. So I ended up getting this as well. And last but not least, or I'm gonna say the last, but second to last is I ended up getting their carpet brush. So one is their fabric seat dust buster whatever it's just a brush and a carpet brush as well to go ahead and clean and it's nice and colored as well so you could differentiate but the name in the back pretty much tells you what the brushes are made for and last but not least is i ended up getting their ceramic coating so let's see how this performs so the owner is just getting a one layer but i ended up getting the kit so one is Sam is a standalone ceramic coating and then this one just adds a little bit more gloss. So I'm gonna go ahead and pro probably just install both of them just to see how the entire vehicle looks, but the owner really just paid one. It just depends on how I feel during that day whether I'm gonna install you know, the two, the two layer or not. I'm gonna get more info on this. This way I actually apply it as properly as possible. But the other thing is, you guys already know, I do work in a garage. But at the same time, it's starting to get winter and it's about 60 degrees outside and the humidity varies. So I really want to test how versatile this Labo Cosmetica line is because a lot of us as, I'm not gonna say a lot of us, but you know, a lot of you guys are DIYers and you guys don't have the proper garage, the proper lighting, the perfect temperature to go ahead and do your vehicle. So it's good to see how well this performed in my environment. And this way you guys can go ahead and use the products that actually works in, you know, in the area the way it's supposed to be. So I'm excited to go ahead and try this line. So stay tuned for that video. 
And other than that, I will see you guys on the next one. Peace. And also, all the products will be down below in the description for you guys to go ahead and order. But if you guys want to wait until I actually do the video from start to finish using the entire product line, you guys could wait for that as well. So stay tuned for that video probably next week or whatever it is decides when I edit the video and release it. So I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.